Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today I'll be showing you my solo trip to South Korea. For this flight, I reserved it with Delta and Korean Air and it was about 14 hours. When I finally touched down to Korea, I took a international taxi to my hotel. Um, where I was staying was the Crown Park Hotel in Myeongdong. The fare was about $85, which I didn't think was too bad, especially if you're afraid of taking the subway. The hotel was quite nice. I was able to get it for a discount on Expedia. So I'll definitely recommend booking your hotel maybe two to three months prior just to get that special price. For the first day, I headed down to Hyundai Mall. This mall was so huge, it had about like eight floors to it. Um, each store was so aesthetic, had such cute clothing and accessories. I definitely recommend stopping by here if you're in the Gangnam area. I had to stop and show you guys this restroom. It was so pretty and I really liked the fact that there was vanities in here. Here I visited Myeongdong Street. Uh, this was definitely an all-day thing. It was so fun, so many things to choose from. Um, I went to Myeongdong about twice on this trip, uh, just so I could try out the night market as well. On day three, I decided to wake up early. I wanted to try this place called Butterfinger. It was quite popular on TikTok and it did not disappoint. Next stop was Over Deep Cafe located in Yeonnam. This cafe was so cool. It was underwater themed. It was about two stories. I spent a good two and a half hours here.
after visiting the Coex Mall, I would have to say I definitely prefer this one over the Hyundai Mall. There's a lot more fun activities such as the aquarium, the Coex Library, and the SM Entertainment Store. And on my last day, I was just preparing for my flight. It was about 13 hours this time on my way back home. I had so much fun in Korea. I can't wait to go back. I'm already missing it. And I hope you guys enjoyed this video.